G'day, g'day from Down Under. This is Aussie Mystery Pop. And my mate Ollie. Say g'day. Um, right, today. This one's um, kept me up a little bit. Not expensive. Um, this box I ordered from eBay. Now, the description on this box, I'm gonna show you the box first. The box is, hello. It's got, it had my address on it that many spots. There was no way it was not gonna get here. But, yeah, I don't know. I don't know, there's supposed to be six pops in this box. There's a few dents on the, I don't know. And a security seal, always good to have a security seal. Oh, I don't know what the security seal's for. I have no idea. Um, good part is it's got Funko on the side. So, there might be pops in here. Description. This 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 box was a box I ordered online. I bid online. It says Funko Pop Vinyl Mystery Box, exclusive and random chase. Uh, and then in the description, the item description, box of six. That's it. It doesn't say what sort of chases or what sort of exclusive and where, it does nothing, nothing. So then I checked the seller's information, uh, nothing. No history, nothing sold before. Yeah, this is dodgy. Um, yeah, so this is about as far out as I'm gonna go. I ended up paying, I started a little bit of a bidding war, I started at like $10, so I wasn't gonna stay there obviously. But then there was a $25 bid and then there was a, a $50 bid. It was like 2 o'clock in the morning and I thought, oh my goodness me. And I figured out that, well, I thought to myself, $10 a pop. That's usually, I don't spend any more than $10 a pop. So I put a bid for $51 and, well, I won it. Uh, you throw on $10 for shipping, $60. Bucks. $60 bucks mystery box with six pops, supposedly six pops. I'll show you a look at the picture. This is a picture, and the only picture. I know there's three of them, but they're exactly the same. That's the picture. Let me see that. And it says, I think it says, uh, my scary pop box. I'm not sure. But that picture is not this box. So again, I said this is what I wanted to do with this channel. I wanted to get dodgy, but not too dodgy. I think this is one step above above dark web. I'm hoping that there is not a big bag of box of old tissues. Um, so yeah, let's um, rip it open and see what we got. Like I said, it's not a lot of money, 60 bucks. 60 bucks is still 60 bucks. If we can get six pops in here that are in okay condition, well obviously I can't I can give them to friends and whatnot, but I can't go selling them or swapping them and meat. So if they're rubbish, they're going to have to stay with me. Yeah, anyway, enough talking. Let's just get on with it. I don't want to keep these videos too long. Enough tape on here. I'm going to cut through just in case because it doesn't look like there's a lot of packing in this box. Goodness me. All right. Oh, hello. Well. Straight up, I'm pretty happy because there are six pops in the box. Happy days. And one's in a pop protector. What I'll do is I'll stick them down here. So not, oh, table down here. Let's get them out. All right, first up in our mystery box, <laughs> we have, with a little bit of damage, yeah, is um, Pink Ranger. I haven't got any Power Rangers. Didn't really grow up with Power Rangers. I'm a bit old for Power Rangers. But now, I have a Pink Power Ranger. Um, you can see where the sticker's been on it. You know, I, don't know, I can't imagine this pop would be worth too much. How about if we have a real quick look on Stashpedia? And we'll just use Stashpedia. Again, I use Stashpedia just to know what's in my collection so I'm, I'm not out there and grabbing stuff that I've got twice and 
I've converted it to Aussie dollars, but it's still, it's not really what we go for. We go for eBay, that's probably much our best idea. All right, that's trending for $11. Pink Ranger, let's move this along a bit quicker. Oh, nice, nice. I like this one, I haven't got this one. Box is in, hey, box is in really good condition, this one. That was okay condition. I'd, I'd, I'd give that to someone happily, knowing that it's not the best, but it's not necessarily good. This one, this one's staying with me. This is Porgy, and I believe he's a variant. Because if we look at the box, he's just in that pose. And I'm actually after the chase of him, where he's got his, he's just got his mouth open pretty much. Bit on him a few times, but it starts off reasonably decent, then it just gets silly. But he's sort of trending around about, I know he's trending around about $40, $45 online, but then you've got to add your postage as well, so. And that's just, I'm not gonna spend, I'll just wait for a bit for Porgy. Oh God, you know, people don't always watch it, you just gotta be the right place at the right time sometimes. Uh, he's trending on Stash for uh, $18. Hang on, we're doing all right. We wanna get $10 a pop. We're already over that. I'll be over, I'll be over. This is an oldie. Haven't seen that pop. Haven't seen that pop. Box condition. Not mint, but pretty good. Actually, I have no problem. A little bit on the bottom, but that's can clean up. I'd have no problem at all in trading that one, but I'm not going to. So I'm going to keep her. That's a pretty awesome pop. Hello. Right, I just checked Stash P. Yeah. I'll be on the same one. It's coming up. It's got the Hot Topic sticker on it, obviously. It hasn't got the Hot Topic on here. But she's trending at $30. All right. That's interesting. What else we got? Moving on. Oh, a bit of box damage here. This one's not the best. It's creased on the side, pretty pretty bad. A little bit on the top, not so bad. But this is Bones, Star Trek Beyond. I haven't got any Star Trek pops. Another little ding in the corner down the bottom. So this one I'll probably, if I decide to get more of them or if I come across more of them, I'll probably just take him out of the box and display him on his own. But hey, Star Wars. I'm definitely a Star Wars man. I grew up with Star Wars. Star Wars is pretty good. So I'm happy with that one. And if we can get it. He's trending for $13. So far, we're killing it. Out of a dodgy mystery box. Uh, what have we got? What's this Grindle? You boys know what this one is? Um, Fantastic Beasts. I'm going to find them. Fantastic Beasts. So I, again, I don't know what this one is. But... Hey, the box in this is in, hey, this is in mint condition, this one. Give you a look at him. I have seen these down at, where were we looking? We're looking at down at EB, EB Games and Zing. I have seen him, because I've seen the, the critters. I open critters down there. A little bit of scuffing on the front, but that's easy enough fixed. All right, so let's have a see what he's trending at. trending uh, no data no data yet all it's come up with is this, well, there's obviously a chase version of him so guess what I'll be looking for the chase version of him because <laughs> it's a chase and we all know I love chases anyway you'd have to be at least 10 bucks you think but it's a new pop you probably even more in the shops and the one we have with our protector on again that's in really good condition. Um, it's a 2017 exclusive. How do you say that one, Bodhi? Rogue One Star Wars. I don't mind the old Star Wars. Kids are laughing at me because they think I'm silly. Kids are taking care of the camera, but they're really bull feds. Uh, he's going for... Trending for, isn't it pop protector, so, I don't know, $17, I would have put the other one in the pop protector, anyway, so, what do we got, Ollie, what do we got, 
we have six pops in a box. A mystery box that no information on. It was pretty out there for information. Worked out to be really good. This one's an absolute win. Yeah? Because I've got my 60 bucks easy. Um, I've got more. I'm bidding on more mystery boxes. Uh, they're getting a bit more expensive. I actually got one coming that's only got two pops in a box. And it doesn't say much more than that, two pops in a box. And it was only like oh, 20, 25 dollars delivered. So I've got one of them coming. But I've also got, I'm putting in for some more. Anyway, this is what I want to do. First one up, first major one up is a winner. Um, if you want to see more, like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment. Tell me what you think these are actually worth in, you know, for, for the Aussie, my Aussie market really, because I'm just using Stash Betty because I don't want to be making 20 minute videos. So give us a like, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, throw some comments down, say you love it, say you don't love it, say you get a haircut, you hippie, whatever you like. Anyway, from Molly, got fleas, stop scratching. Cheers, cheers from Molly. Cheers for me.